I'm uh, Betsy Ross Mebbin, and uh, I was a cheerleader here my freshman through senior year, and I do not allow blue in my house. You had to really kind of love Riddick Stadium. First of all, it was on campus, so you just walked to it. You kind of thought it was going to fall down whenever you walked on it. But it was still fun. I mean, you were literally right there on top of the football field. And then when we moved to Carter, it was like, where is this place? There was nothing out there. It was just this thing in the middle of all the cow pastures, which was appropriate given that we were in Z State. Um, but, it was, but it was still exciting. And again, it's exciting because you've looked at the growth. You know, when, when I was there, we only had a big, gigantic hill that was grass. And then you also had the Finley Fieldhouse at the other end. I was lucky enough to be able to uh, present a football to Mr. Carter at the halftime dedication of the stadium. One of the things that I remember most, of course, when I was going to school here, I was a cheerleader, so I always knew exactly what I was wearing to the game. And then I remember the first game I went to after I graduated, it was like, oh no, I've got to go buy clothes. I have to buy a dress, I have to buy heels, because back then everybody dressed up. But I was also here when we beat Florida State for the first time, and that was very exciting. Uh, and of course, anytime you beat Carolina. And then actually when I moved away and I moved to Pennsylvania, I actually got season tickets just so I would have tickets to come back to one game a year. I love our fans. I, lo I think NC State fans are the best because they are loyal. Do we always show up? Yeah, we always show up. And we show up year after year regardless. Are we loud? Yes, we are incredibly loud. What I remember most was the Bucky Boys because they could do the best two-minute drill in the entire world. You didn't even worry about the rest of the game. You knew in the last two minutes that those two were just going to go marching down the field. Anybody that knows me will tell you that they all know what school I went to. And so every year I post on Facebook that picture of me kissing Carter. It's a very special memory to me. If we, have, if we are playing football on the weekend, then I have on my NC State stuff, regardless of whether it's a home game or a away game.